What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of the Knowledge Bomb. Ooh, what's up? Episode 488. Mama, we're 12 from 5 Hundo. That's pretty good. All right, 488, band refresher. Now, we've had some really strong guys that follow the program online that have to just make it, you know, put it together in their own way with their bands, whether it's in their garage, their commercial gym. But I want you to understand that the bands are set up for the three major movements the exact same way. Now, there was a really good lifter, I forget his name, but a really good lifter that tagged me in a deadlift the other day that had his bands looped this way, which is a single loop over top of the bar. And as you can see, that doesn't give you no tension, right? That is not what you're watching in the 4 a.m. crew. Let, let me like make that real clear. So when we use, whether it's the red bands or the black bands, no matter what movement it is, we are doubling them up. So when I say there is one band on something, it is doubled up. It's never, oh, that's what I call two. There's a lot of people that make mistakes that they put one on and because it's doubled up, they think that's two bands. Nah, what you're watching in the morning is four actual bands doubled up three actual bands doubled up. So I'm gonna show you guys on bench real quick. So, on bench, this is our, red, uh, our west side barbell mini band. The loops will both go over top of the bar. Just like that. Now, if you're setting this up and you don't have a pin and you use a dumbbell, I'll show you this real quick because I think this will be relevant to our knowledge bomb because a lot of people train on their own. You would put it against the rack like this, okay? And then you would loop 25 is not gonna hold this, you need like an 80 or something. But then you would loop it up over. So then your bar path is in your natural like pressing motion, okay? So once again, doubled up. So if I go over here to squat, and we'll go to deadlift, there's a gang of bands already sitting here from the morning and from the high school kids. This is a black band, it's doubled up. We got two 100s crossed. Then I'll go up over the bar, like so. Okay, once again, dumbbells smashed up against the rack. So when I unrack it for a front squat or back squat, I'll keep my legs kind of in my normal position. I'm not gonna, you know, unrack it like this. I'm going here, stepping out, I'm in good position. I squat, I put it back. Same for deadlift. Like I said, no different. I'll take both loops up over the bar like so. Then the difference of that tension, much different than what I showed you before. So this is a band refresher of what you're seeing on the Get Stack Plan, what you're watching in these videos, and how actually difficult this is so you can get better. Knowledge Bomb, episode 488. Ba Boom.